What's going on everybody? So I'm back in the video. Hope everyone's having a great day. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to purchase crypto uh, pancake swap using the brand new feature, which is not really new, but it's the Wallet Connect feature on the Trustful application. So if you guys didn't know, the decentralized app section, which is also known as the browser tab in the Trustful app has been removed on Apple devices only. So if you're on Android, you should still have the browser tab. So apparently on iOS, it did violate App Store's guidelines. So that's why it was removed and Trustful had to remove it from iOS devices only. So just to kind of clear things up, if you're on Android, you will still have this. So I'm gonna be showing you guys today on how to use this on like I'm using the wall connect uh, feature, which is in the trust wall app. So it's a kind of an alternative method. So for some of you guys, you may still have it working because you're not on the latest version. So for me, mine's kind of glitched right now, but I still can actually go to pancakes up through the trust wallet app. But if, like I said, if it's not working for you guys, it's not loading. What you want to do is go to any mobile browser on your device. Safari will work, Google Chrome, Firefox, any browser that just has some search engines. So I'm going to be using Safari in this video. So what you guys want to do is head to the official PancakeSwap website right here. So PancakeSwap.Finance and then click on the three little lines in the upper left hand corner. Click on trade and then exchange because we're going to be purchasing some tokens. So I'm going to go from BNB and in this video, I'm going to be purchasing some safe moon. So any crypto you'd like to switch the slippage if you need to. For me, for safe moon, you get to switch it to about 11 or 12 percent. So I've already done that. Say your transaction may be front run. That's OK. So from here, enter the amount of BNB that you want to go to safe moon. So put 0.05 and then unlock wallet right here. So you want to type on unlock wallet and then you will see trust wallet, but that won't work. It's going to give you an error if you click on that or nothing will uh, happen. So that's why we're going to be using the wallet connect feature. So tap on that, tap on your preferred wallet. So we're using the trust wallet also works for like MetaMask, Crypto.com. So I'm going to be using trust wallet. It's going to redirect us to the trust wallet application where we can do the wallet connect. So tap on connect and this is you can now go back to your browser. So we're going to go back to Safari and you guys see your wallet should connect right there. So here you can now tap on swap, confirm swap. It's going to bring us back to the trust wallet where we can confirm the purchase and then we'll tap on send right there. So now we can go back again and you guys see the transaction has been submitted and we can view it on the BSC scan right here. So now we just have to wait till it goes through. So we can now go to our trust wallet app right now. We can also cancel the wallet connect this um, session right there. So now if we refresh the page, we should have some safe moon and you guys can see we just purchased that amount, which is 0.05. So this is the brand new feature, not brand new. Like I said, it's kind of old, but not a lot of people did use it. So it's the wallet connect feature which is the brand new way on iOS devices. So like I said, you only have this if you're on the latest version of the trust wallet on iOS devices. So um, this is how you're going to be having to do this for any other um, tokens, such as if you're going to be purchasing off like PancakeSwap or Uniswap. So yeah, guys, that's basically it for video. Hope you guys did enjoy this one. If you did if you have any questions, drop a comment down below and like the video. Hit that subscribe button and that post notification bell so you guys don't miss a video. That's basically it, and I'll see you guys in the next one.